Ladies and gentlemen, warmly welcome to open joint external evaluation process on health security to one of the most happy countries of the world, at least according to the World Economic Forum service. So this is one of the happiest countries in the world, but if you don't see so many happy faces around you, that's just because it's Monday morning. But I'm sure it's getting better during the week. Finland is celebrating its 100th anniversary of independence this year. The topic of the centenary year is together. Together as a topic is not just a slogan. It is the way we have prepared the centenary year. It is the way we want to celebrate our independence. But together is also the way we try to do things in this country together. As a small nation, we just can't afford to anything else but trying to join other forces. Therefore, I think it's more than appropriate that today we are gathered here together to assess how is Finland doing on health sector. Doing things together is also the principle of Agenda 2030 which is globally accepted agenda for sustainable development. As we know, the need to strengthen national capacity for health risks is one of the targets under goal three of the agenda. In Finland, the government has adopted a comprehensive and concrete action plan for the national implementation of Agenda 2030. There are two main focus areas in the action plan, coal-free and resource-wise Finland and equal and competent Finland. So, for example, decreasing health differences between different demographic groups is one of the targets of national implementation of Agenda 2030. Ladies and gentlemen, we are living in a world of ever-increasing interdependencies. Therefore, it is necessary to assess and develop security in a comprehensive way and from the intersectoral perspective. To guarantee the security of our society, we have to take into account all sectors in society. In Finland's security strategy for society, we have defined vital functions to society and given responsibility to secure them in all situations. The role of business community and third sector is recognized as well. Mr. Vesa Valtonen, Secretary General of the Security Committee, will tell you more details about our comprehensive approach uh, to security afterwards. Health security is an important element of our security strategy. Health security work is carried out from the point of view of overall saf safety and by all branches of government. In health security work, the authorities, business life and organizations are together preparing for biological chemical, radiation, and other cross-border threats. These threats can endanger the health of people and animals and can endanger even the security of the whole society. Therefore, national health security is the responsibility of the highest government level. Ladies and gentlemen, security in society builds on the arrangements made in normal conditions. 
This applies also to health sector. Preparedness to act on crisis situation depends on the actions we take in normal conditions. Receiving reliable information about the strengths and weaknesses of our health security system is essential for the further development. This information is needed now when we are in normal conditions, if anything in today's work can be normal, for us to be better secured if something exceptional happens. The purpose of the joint external evaluation is to help the country to draw up a multi-sectoral plan for health security capacity building. The voluntary external assessment is neither an end product nor an inspection. It is the beginning of a process for capacity building grounded in the country commitment to improve its capacity to prevent, detect and respond to all threats. It is my great pleasure to welcome the external evaluation team here. I trust this evaluation can really contribute to our National Health Security Week and I wish you all a successful, interesting week here in Finland. We are eager to hear about the findings later this week on Friday. Warmly welcome and have a nice starting session this morning and an enjoyable week here in Finland. Thank you.